Tetsuo! Okay. Welcome back to Final Fantasy VII. We're about to figure out how the hell this works. I guess I have access to... Wait, okay. Uh, attack on left and attack on right. Wait. Wait, that's left. Oh, God. What the hell is this? Oh, wait. Okay, I'm really confused. Oh, God. What the hell? This is just a different game entirely. Oh, fuck off. Fuck off from my friends. Wait, so okay was the right buttons. Okay, this is weird. Because apparently, if, if I'm correct, if I'm right, I still, oh God, oh God. Okay, the left, left bumper is the left attack. A button is the right attack. Why, I don't know. I mean, it's, I guess it's technically left and right. But, uh, did I hit him? No, oh, I hit that guy. That guy is also dead. I... Okay. Apparently the menu button is still the menu button. Or something. Uh, B... Cancel is form party, which I don't know what that means. Uh... I... Uh, that might have been, like, in the menu or whatever. Maybe I shouldn't have been by myself? I don't know. Oh, this... If there's a boss battle after this that I should have formed a party for, I'm gonna be really fucking... I'm gonna be really fucking screwed! <laughs> Oops. I was not paying attention. Oh, God. Oh, this is the... This is the weirdest thing. I mean, this is kind of awesome, but this is the weirdest. And I can't hit these guys for shit. No, hit him. Oh, for... There we go. Oh, this is the way. I have a feeling I'm running around on like a circular track or something. Or maybe not. Maybe I'm, this is actually like a linear track or something. Oh, go oh, come on, really? Oh yeah, that's fair. Uh, <laughs> got both of them in one hit. Oh, this is just. Wow, what the fuck? I mean, this. Oh God. Oh boy. Oh, this is gonna get really... Oh, here we go. Boss battle time here. And I didn't form a party. Please don't tell me I'm fighting this by myself. Please don't tell me... Oh, thank God. Thank God. That's some bullshit. I was facing it, but whatever. Oh, that didn't do that much. Oh, great, it's a transformer. Oh, oh! I'm so not ready for this. Okay, that was dumb. Magic. Uh, bio fire. Fuck it. I don't know. You're gonna be bolt. And potato sends it for now. Tell me what its weaknesses are. Tell me how much health it has because this is a fucking gauntlet of bosses I need to fight right now. Last episode. This episode. Twenty three. It's weak against lightning, but wow! Oh. Oh, I'm about to. I'm about to have a bad time. Uh, well, that does actually do a lot of damage, so at least there's that. Can I steal anything from him? It'd be really funny if I could. Um. Uh. Do not want. Do not want. Twin burner. I don't want twin burner. No way. Oh. Oh. I felt that. Seal. No. Seal. God damn it. Potato. Just. Just attack it. I don't know. Uh. Salmon. Ooh. I forget what the. Oh. Beat rush. That's it. Or something. I still need to figure out how her fucking limit break works. Ow. No. Uh. Magic. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm just gonna keep doing the fuck out of that. Uh, potato. Yeah, if every single time that Yarnaby attacks, it does two, 250 damage, then this might be a short battle after all. Uh, let's do some curing. I think we should cure a little bit. Bolt. I mean, like, she's not gonna do that much damage anyway, so... Yeah, we're all, oh, we're really gonna need some cure right now. Mind blow. I don't remember this one. 
Oh. Oh, they all have their limit breaks now. Oh. Oh, he don't. What? Oh, two yes. Oh. Yarnaby. Uh, let's do uh, just do, let's do classic braver. Uh, Yarnaby, do not protect. You have 26 health. Uh, who's up next? Salmon. Why is Salmon's thing not going up? Somebody. Oh God, Salmon. I need to do cure. Oh. Uh, on Yarnaby, yes. Thank God she's. Thank God this thing is only attacking, fucking Salmon. Because if he attacked Yarnaby, I would be so fucked. Not right now. Now I'm good. But like, if he had attacked Yarnaby at any point during that, I would have been so fucked in in this battle. Uh, let's sense him just to see how I'm doing. And just for the hell of it, let's cure Motato because yeah, he kind of needs that too. Oh, Motato's about to die. No, he's not. He is holding on. He is holding on. He is living on a prayer right now. But two more attacks by Yarnaby and he should be dead. But he is living on a prayer right now. Holy shit, that is so uncomfortable. Uh, bolt him. Just keep bolting. Fucking attack him, I don't care. Uh, fire. I don't think it'll do anything, but whatever. It's basically, it's basically Yarn Beast battle. Oh, that is so uncomfortable. Thank God I had a party of three, because if I hadn't, I would have been so fucked. And I would have had to go all the way back to the last point I saved, which was quite a while back. And I am not about to do that shit again. Bolt him. Bolt him? Yeah. Here we go. I'm saving that limit break because you is dead. You dead, boy. Oh, God. <laughs> hey, she gained somersault. What does that mean? Probably something good. Oh, God, that was uncomfortable. Oh, okay. yeah, I, I thought the game broke for a second, I was about to say. Well, what do we do now? R uh, I don't know. Have you ever seen the movie Thelma and Louise? Uh, Sephiroth is alive. I have to settle the score. Who's Sephiroth? What score do you have to settle? Will that save the planet? It seems so. Then I'm going. Come, Shade. Walk slower to me, please. I'll go too. There are things I need to know. About the ancients? Many things. I guess it's goodbye, Midgar. Where is... Where is Sephiroth? I, I don't know where Sephiroth is. <sighs> God damn it. Oh, I have to walk now? Great, I was about to take a drink of water. Uh, I guess it's the start of our journey. This is like episode 20! The fuck have I been doing for the last five hours? You hate traveling? I don't know, but I don't have anyone else to go, so I guess it doesn't really matter whether I like to travel or not. I'm going back to my hometown. I'll go with you as far as that. Is it, wait, he, wait, he has a hometown? You know what? This is the first time I've ever left Midgar. Uh... A little. No, maybe a lot. But I have a bodyguard, right? Yeah, about that. Uh, we told Shay's mom to go somewhere safe, so Marlene should be safe too. She should be, yeah. She said she didn't want to stay in Midgar anymore. Maybe it's for the best. Then, let's stay here for, now. let's go. There's nothing left for us here. We need a leader for our journey. Of course, that could only be me, yeah, right. <laughs> you think so? No. I think it should be Yarn to be. <laughs> Fuck, all right. Uh, go northeast to a town called Calm. If something happens, we'll meet up there. Northeast, okay. Hoorah! Sides, we can't all be strolling around out there. It's too dangerous. Let's split into two parties. So, who do I want in my party? 
Uh, I'll take Amsterdam. No, I can't replace Yarnaby. Uh, that's what I want. You know what? I'm taking Salmon. Salmon's really pulled through for me. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, no. Yeah. Yeah, you two, take care. Later, at calm. I mean, aren't we going that way also? I don't really know. Saving on the world map. On the world map, access to menu anytime select to save. Oh, I can save anywhere out here. Cool. I think I'll do that right now. Okay. So, this is Midgar, this tiny little thing. All right, so yeah, I really shouldn't be surprised that as a Final Fantasy game, it has a world map. Uh, but now that does beg the question, where the fuck do I go? All right, north. East, they said. Although, if it's anything like what I know, um, the town's probably gonna be up there. There might be a few more other battles and shit. I'm skipping this. <laughs> Anyways, uh, apparently I had something stolen of mine. I don't know why I pressed that button. So, northeast, calm, right? Uh, goddamn. I'm not used to this idea of being able to save anywhere I want now. I'm guessing this is calm. I have to run into the house. Ooh. This place does feel nice and quaint. Also, those dials are very, uh, gif-like. So this is calm. We're supposed to meet at the inn. Shall we go? Let's go, Yarnaby. Nah, okay, whatever. I'm guessing these are all shops to restock stuff, which thankfully... I should be able to do now that I'm here. But I'm gonna go into the inn first because that's what I was told to do and I'm a good little boy. Uh... Your party is waiting for you on the second floor. Thank you! <sighs> Fuck, it is really fucking hot here. God damn it, Summer! Be winter already! You don't wanna be late. I was late by what, a minute? Yo, menu. Oh, fuck off, dude. Sorry to keep you waiting. What? What? Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button. <laughs> Guess everybody's here now. So let's hear your story. You know, the one about Sephiroth, the crisis on the planet. Let's hear it all. Yeah. I kind of do need to figure out what the hell is going on here. I used to want to be like Sephiroth, so I joined Soldier. Don't you dare make noises at me right now. I'm in the middle of making a fucking video. Don't be fucking rude, phone. After working with Sephiroth on several missions, we became friends. You call that a friend? Yeah, well, he was older than me and hardly ever talked about himself. Sundare. <laughs> so I guess you'd call us, call us war buddies. We trusted each other. Until one day. One day, flashback time. After the war, it was soldiers' duty to put down any resistance against the Shinra. That was five years ago. I was 16. It sure is raining hard. Hey, how are you doing? Hey, how are you? Thanks for the wave. I'm alright. I wouldn't know. I've never had motion sickness. Uh, everything okay? Blah, 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 blah. Flashbacks are boring. Hey. I don't know what voice I'm gonna give Sephiroth yet, even if I will give him a voice. Maybe I'll give him, like, an extremely, uh, robotic voice on it that says it down. <laughs> they gave me some new materia. I can't wait to use it. Just like a kid. You gonna brief us about this mission? This isn't a typical mission. <laughs> Good! Why do you say- I don't, why am I doing a robotic voice still? Why do you say that? I joined Soldier to be like you. But by the time I made first class, the war was already over. My big hopes of becoming a hero like you ended with the war. 
That's why I always sign up whenever there's a big mission. Kind of a way to prove myself. How do you feel, Mr. Sephiroth? I thought you wanted a briefing. Why do you look like you're a member of a 90s boy band? Oh, uh, our mission is to investigate an old Mako reactor. There have been reports of it malfunctioning and producing brutal creatures. First, we will dispose of those creatures. Then, we'll locate the problem and neutralize it. Brutal creatures? Where? At the Mako reactor! Are you not fucking listening? Nibelheim. That's where I'm from. <gasps> Hometown. Oh god. T sir, something strange just crashed into the truck. My hopes and dreams. That will be our mo- Oh. I don't care. Oh, okay, I was about to say. If I lose this battle, do I, like, lose my memory of the fucking, uh... Oh, okay, never mind then. I wasn't supposed to be able to win that battle. <laughs> Oops. Sephiroth's strength is incredible. He is far stronger in reality than any stories you may have heard about him. So where do you come in? Thank god the fucking battle killed me before I had a chance to do anything. I was mesmerized by the way Sephiroth fought. And then we reached Nibelheim. I thought I was dead. How does it feel? It's your first time back to your hometown in a long time, right? It was like first person, whatever. So how does it feel? I wouldn't know because I don't have a hometown. Uh, how about your parents? What are parents? My mother is Genova. She died right after she gave birth to me. My father was also Genova. We don't talk about our, my parents very much. What are you laughing? What does this matter? Alright, let's go. Is this actually- oh. oh okay, never mind. I was say, like, am I just first person the entire time? Yay! <laughs> I just want to imagine you're going to be in the room with all his friends being like, and then I ran around Sephiroth like an idiot for five hours. And they're just like sitting there like watching his- Yarnaby like describes the entire encounter, it's like, and then I did a third loop, and then I did a fourth loop, and then I did a fifth loop, then I went the opposite direction, and they're just all sitting there uncomfortably like, uh, uh well, I thought you were gonna tell us something important, dude. Fucking ant! <laughs> fucking hate ants. Why are they all over my goddamn desk? Okay. And the Mako smell is pretty bad here. I guess I have to go forward? Yo, wait a minute. Whoa, isn't that, uh, the name of Sephiroth's mother? G Genova? Or Genev- whatever the fuck it was, Genova? I remember Genova. That's that damn headless spook living in the Shinra- Oh! Wait, what? That's what- oh, that- oh yeah, that was Genova. That's right. Well, Jada, would you please let us hear what Yarnaby has to say? You can ask questions later. <laughs> Q&A is at the end of the presentation. <laughs> Sam and I was only. You want to be continue. Story time. The childhood friends reunite. I was really surprised with Sam and. The town was quiet. Everyone must be in their houses, afraid to come out because of the monsters. But no, maybe they're afraid of us. We leave for the reactor at dawn. Make sure to get sleep early. At the end, I guess. Can't move, so. <laughs> All we need is one lookout. So you others get some rest. Oh, and you may visit your family and friends. Yay! I can visit my family and friends. Wait, this looks like calm. Well, it, no, it isn't. It's a different town entirely. Alright, well, I'm gonna... The video's getting a bit long-winded already anyways. I'm gonna call it quits here, but I will keep going with the fucking cutscene. So next time on Final Fantasy VI, we shall finish up this little flashback episode and... 
Well, let's see where we let's see where we end up. See you guys next time.